Good afternoon, mga kapamilya! Welcome to the official media announcement of Star Magic. I am Ria Ataide, your host for today's event. And in just a few moments, we will be introducing the newest addition to the growing family of Star Magic, who recently signed in the biggest and grandest contract signing event ever, the Star Magic Black Pen Day. The said event was seen on our YouTube channel and Facebook page and across various ABS-CBN platforms. It was truly a momentous event, not just for Star Magic and its newest set of artists, but also for the supporters who have waited so long to see their favorites shine even brighter. So let's all relive the experience as Star Magic Black Pen Day will air again on A to Z and Capamilia channel on July 4. So watch out for that. But for now, let me greet everyone who is watching us via live stream. Hello po sa inyong lahat na nakatutok sa amin ngayon, live sa Star Magic Philippines and ABS-CBN social media accounts. I'd also like to greet our friends from the print and online media na kasama natin sa Zoom ngayon. Alam ko po, you're all excited to virtually meet the 13 artists who will join us today. But before anything else, I'd like to request everyone to please use our official hashtag Hashtag, hashtag Star Magic Black Pen Day on all your social media posts related to this event. So yeah, let's get the ball rolling. Let me introduce the first group of new artists who joined our growing family in Star Magic. First, we have the daughter of veteran actors Jackie Lou Blanco and Ricky Davao. It will only be a matter of time, and I know this, that she will make her own mark in showbiz. So everyone, watch out for Arabella Davao. Hi, hi everyone. Hi. Hello to everyone here on Zoom and everyone watching online. Hello. Coming from an esteemed family of movie producers and great actors, their name has been in showbiz since Tale as Old as Time. Now continuing their legacy as he joins the upcoming drama, Marry Me, Marry You, Give It Up for Luis Vera Perez. Hi guys. Hello po sa Hello. Her breakout role came in 2016 when she played the lead in Direct Mikhail Red's award-winning film, Birdshot. This then opened plenty of doors for her in mainstream media, such as roles in Los Bastardos and Walang Hanggang Paalam. And now, finally, she is in Star Magic. Please welcome Mary Joy Apostol. Hello po sa inyo lahat and sa mga kasama po namin dito. Hi, Majoy. <laughs> Fun fact, his father, Victor Neri, was actually part of the first ever batch of then Talent Center. And what a full circuit, full circle, it was now as his son joins this new chapter for Star Magic. Hoping to be one versatile actor and a future director, here is Vita Neri. Hi guys, so mga nasa Zoom and to, ones, to the ones watching, hello, good afternoon. From his many stints in the indie scene, such as Bar Boys and Buckwit Boys, and also Dead Kids, with the latter paving way for more acting projects, he is now part of the little-known drama series, FPJ's Ang Provinciano, and will soon be exhibiting more of his acting prowess, along with me in the upcoming series, Viral. Give it up for Vance Lorena. Hello everyone. Hello po sa mga kaibigan natin sa media. Long time no see. Sa lahat po na nanonood, hello po sa inyo. Enjoy po tayo. Hi, Ri. Hi, Vance. Ito naman. Fierce eyes and head to toe modeling are but a few terms she has been familiar with ever since she won the fifth cycle of Asian Connect. But now she's a deep dive into acting as she signs with Star Magic. And this 2021, an upcoming film with reality entertainment. Please welcome Maureen Robb. Hi, everyone. Hi. Uh, hello. Can you hear me? Yung, ano, ako pala yung internet unstable. Wait a moment. Let oh. me reconnect my internet. I can hear you. I can it's, hear you. I'm, I'm okay. I'm okay. <laughs> Hey, hello? Is my internet okay? Ang hirap ng Zoom! Oh my goodness! Hello, first batch! How are you guys feeling? How is this for you guys? Vito, Luis, Majo, Vance, ba ah. I'm excited to be here today. <laughs> it's so exciting. Yeah, yeah, super excited. How does it feel, guys, now that you're part of Star Magic? It's such an honor. <laughs> Boys, kayo, anong pakiramdam? Star Magic, hello, welcome mga kapatid. 
in my family. Star Magic siblings. <laughs> so, sobrang dream come true to kasi ano, ilang beses din na ako nag-audition sa Star Magic. Ngayon lang yung pagkakataon natanggap ako. Kaya ayan, thank you sa Star Magic. How about you, Vito, Majoy, Luis? Kamusta naman ang experience so far? Still can't um, believe Sorry, Vito. <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. But yeah, still can't believe it sometimes. Very grateful talaga for the opportunity given to me. Super. Happy, happy. I would assume all of you have... Hindi, malungkot tayo. Malungkot tayo. At <laughs> <laughs> o sige na, bago pa mapahaba tong kwentuhan natin, let's open the floor for our question and answer with our media guests. And to help us moderate today, I'd like to call, of course, none other than Ate Tess Gubi of Star Magic. Hi, Ate Tess. Hello and good afternoon to everyone. Okay, medyo mahaba ang araw natin today. We'll start our Q&A. Let's call Michael Almasen of Vix Box. Hi, Vix. Hi, Bix. Hi. Hello. Hi, everyone. Congrats sa mga bagong Star Magic Artist. Uh, my first questions uh, for Vans. Vans, ikaw ba ngayong Star Magic Artist ka na? Uh, are you going to, uh, parang, ano yung career na gusto mong tahakin? Uh, And, ngayong Star Magic Artist na po, gusto ko lang po talaga... Uh, vocal po ako dito. Gusto ko lang po talaga magtanga, ma, matagal, magtagal sa industriya. At uh, ayun, makilala na hanggang sa pagtanda ko na patuloy na umaarte. Ikaw ba? Mas gusto mo nung ano, tago ito? Uh, yung may ka-love team o yung prefer mo na solo lang? Hindi naman po ako binibigyan ng ka-love team eh. <laughs> Ayos naman po ako sa pag-solo lang. <laughs> At least. Ah, gusto ko nga pala yung outfit mo nung ano, nung uh, contract signing. <laughs> Ang bongga. Gusto ko yung outfit mo ngayon. Namiss kita. Thank Basta you. Ka I miss you din. <laughs> and congrats kasi diba, sabi mo nga kanina, inang beses ka nag-audition sa Star Magic and finally, ito na nga, uh, official artist ka na. Yes po. Uh, ayun, gaya po nang sinabi ko, nag-audition din po ako sa PBB sa Star Magic pero ilang beses po ako hindi natanggap. Kaya, uh, Ayun, siguro dahil mos-mos pa lang po ako noon at kailangan ko pong pagdaanan lahat ng mga pinagdaanan natin para matupad po yung pangarap. Ngayon po, nandito na po tayo ngayon. Kaya sobrang thankful po ako kay Derek Loren at sa lahat po ng bumubuo ng Star Magic. Congrats. Uh, next naman is for... Uh, Thank you, Bix. Kay Luis. Tama ba, Luis? Yes, po. Hi, Luis. Hi, po. <laughs> Hi. I love your outfit ng contract signing. Thank you, po. Ganda rin and, po ng sayo ngayon. Uh, uh, and ano, uh, ano, ba, ano, ma, ano pakinamdam na unang mga projects mo dito as Star Magic Artist, talagang mga challenging role na agad, uh, puro drama na. Like you did MMK now and Marry Me, Marry You. How was it? Did you go na ba sa uh, lock and taping ng Marry Me, Marry You? Yes po, nag-lock and taping na kami and preparing po sa next cycle. And how was the experience to be working with a uh, uh, great actors of our industry. Syempre po ano po, na-fulfill po ng dreams kasi dati idol ko lang po yung mga pinapanood ko dati tapos ngayon ka-work ko na po sila. And sobrang na-pressure kasi sobrang tiwala po namin na isa yung Star Magic and Derek Lauren. <laughs> ano pa yun ng ano? Ano pa yun ng family mo nga 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 ikaw na may magpapatuloy ng uh, legacy nila sa showbiz? Um, syempre po supportive po yung family ko and feeling ko po Pinawayan nila ako maging ako. Ayun po, hindi nila ako sinasabihin ng kahit ano. Basta, ako lang, ako lang magiging ako. <laughs> okay, congrats. Thank, Thank you. you po. Thanks, Bix. Singit ko muna. We have a question here from Don Don Sermina of Abante. Of course, we'll address to Ara, to Migo. Pwede rin si Ria kasi makakarelate dito sa question na ito. And of course, Luis. Ang tindi ng pressure sa mga bagong artist na famous agad ang family names ninyo. Sa so, paano niyo ma-overcome ang pressure at ano ba ang dapat ninyong gawin para malampasan ang kasikatan ng inyong mga family members na talagang senior na sa industriya? Let's start with Ara. Hi everyone. So, you know, I think never naman mawawala yung pressure or yung kaba. 
kumbaga palagi na nandun. But I think kasi I never see it as I have to be better than my parents or kailangan maging mas sikat ako. Kasi, di ba, iba yung achievements nila and alam ko na iba yung magagawa ko. So, siguro uh, that's what I'll tell myself if ever nandun yung pressure. Okay, next we have Luis. So, akin po, um... So, lagi po sana na sabi namin, no, maging ako lang ako, just be yourself. Hindi mo na kailangan mag-please na ibang tao para ano, maging successful sa buhay. Tapos, ayun po. Piling ko magkakaiba kami na achievement ng mga ancestor ko po and family. And ayun po. Ayun po. <laughs> Kaya po, iba po talaga. So, kung ano po yung achievement na makuha ko po, siguro po, akin na lang yan. Sana po maalala ako bilang ako, hindi po yung family name. Agree naman ako dyan. Then, Vito? Um, sorry, what was the question again? Naggulo yung cats ko dito bigla. <laughs> Na-pressure ka ba knowing na kailangan mong gawin at dapat malampasan ang kasikatan ng iyong daddy, Vitor? Uh, di naman. I mean, he told me when I started na just be you and whatever you can achieve. Kasi yun na yun. Parang, don't try to beat me. Because, I mean, I can't eh. Because he's the one and only. And I'm the one and only Vitonary. So, I can't, you know, parang, I can yeah, rival his name. Parang, siguro, in terms of galing. Pero, I don't, I don't think I'll ever, parang, like, like get to, kasi sobrang, we're all unique here. So, parang, he's the one and only Victor That's the one and only Luis Vera Perez. Ara Davao. So, I don't think na parang I'll ever get to him. But I'll get to something na yung sa akin, yung, yung peak ko. Pero sa dad ko, sa kanya na yun. He never pressured me to like live up to him. Okay. Rie, ikaw, gusto mo bang sagutin din ang tanong? Kahit na ikaw yung host? <laughs> Sige, ikaw at Tessa. Inaalay ako bigla. Carry lang. Um... I think hindi talaga mawawala yung pressure even as you... I mean, I've been in the industry for six years now at nandun pa rin yun. Um, I think it's just a matter of changing your mindset and really believing that everybody has different capabilities. Like I said, my brother and my mom have completely different processes for me as an, art, as an artist. And I think it helps a lot na, you know, they're very supportive in what I do. They never made me feel like what I'm doing is inferior or what I'm doing is... You know, they just make me feel like they're there supporting even if what they do is different. But on a personal level, I think it's really uh, conditioning yourself not to be competitive because once the competitiveness hits you in this industry, then things can kind of like spiral from there because I, I realized that in this industry, we have to be working together and not competing with one another. Everybody has their own strengths and weaknesses and it's up to us to really like maximize our strengths. So I get a man, no pressure anymore at the test, thankfully. Yes, that's advice from Ati Ria. Oh, Ati Ria. Ayan, Ri, 